here at Southampton there are a range of different volunteering activities that you can get yourself stuck into. So the first one that comes to my head is active. So that's where you can, students can, are trained to run uh, different sports activities for students that are from disadvantaged backgrounds or students who otherwise wouldn't get to do these kinds of sports at their school. So these are kids between the age of 7 to 14 years old. Then there's also something called Link Ages and that's more of a intergenerational approach where students will be trained to host activities and run small events at care homes and that's kind of designed to kind of boost the morale and spirit of um, older people that are in care homes and it also provides a way for them to kind of make friends, um, speak, talk about their own experiences and kind of mingle. Then of course we have School Plus. So School Plus is actually one thing that I've signed up for this year and what it is is you get to tutor about one to two hours a week. You get to tutor students um, from disadvantaged backgrounds and where they may, they may need help in English or in maths. So all the material is provided for and you're shown exactly what to do and I think it's a very kind of rewarding experience all of those different kind of um, way that you can get involved um, in the community are, I would say they're very re rewarding in the sense that you get to of course make friends with other students but also you get to give back and uh, make a difference in someone else's life and in an older person's life you know depending on the different generations as well it's also a great way to kind of gain experience in terms of leading organizing managing projects and um, working um, in teams and in groups and I think it does a lot for you in terms of your confidence and self-belief so Southampton also has a really good relationship with international organisations. One that comes to mind is Think Pacific. Now Think Pacific offer um, tutoring opportunities and different kind of sports activities and even the chance to build infrastructure in Fiji and to deliver these workshops to families, children, teenagers and adults in Fiji. So with all of these different opportunities, you often receive an email or it also will be on the SUSU website and available for all students to access, read about and sign up if they're interested. 